game Ouch News. Owie. God damn it. Wow, you guys. Yeah, Soulmates. No, I just wanted my own. I want my independence, okay? Yeah, you got your own identity clan. Ow! <laughs> Sounded better when we were harmonizing. It did. <laughs> Submitted by Fresh Paved Roads. Okay, that's, that's it. it is the best. An 11 year old boy had to have surgery to remove 70 magnetic balls from his penis. What the f? 70? Magnetic ball. He was stuffing seven them in. Or 7 D. 7 D. Was he stuffing them through his hole? Yes. yes. Damn, this kid got a big ass dick. Fucking idiot. Dude. But I'm jealous because I can't even stuff a single one in there. <laughs> oh, you probably could. I bet you this kid was like, ooh, this feels good. Ooh, this feels good. Ooh. But nothing feels good going down your urethra. You don't yeah. know. Oh. To each their own, man. There's a lot of people that stick shit in their, ure their urethra. You mean guys? Or even girls. Guys, guys. Cause sometimes when you wash your dick and the soap goes in there a little bit, it hurts. Look at you guys all. Never had soap going like, there. I've Dude, I am too. Oh my God. That shit hurts. It burns oh, a little bit. I don't know, man. That's a we tiny hole. Ma know. Wait, did he think he could pull it out? Like all together? Maybe he, oh maybe he was God. trying to get a bigger magnet and then he was gonna pull him out. And feel, dude, that's a freaky ass kid. I know. No pedophile at all. Eleven. That's like that's Isaac's age. That's he like, was like, he better was check Isaac's dick tonight. Though. Wait, 11? This kid's dumb. I thought he was like five. Maybe it felt good for him. What type, what, what's the age where boys start Fast like? forward six years, Tyga's doing the same thing. <laughs> it's like, so, Tyga, no! Based off my upbringing, 11 is cigarettes, talking to chicks, Learning from older homies how to steal cars. Like, there's actual fun shit to do where you don't have to, like, oh, I wonder what happens to my elbow when I pull That's on your it. weenus. Yeah, my weenus. Like, what happened to my weenus? Like, this is like five year old shit. You know what I mean? Like, stuffing shit on your dick that's five year old. There's actual cool shit you can do now. Like, smoke cigarettes? Smoke cigarettes, graffiti. Like, that's like 11 year old stuff. I wasn't doing that at 11. Me neither. What were you doing? Playing with your clit? With Barbie? What the fuck? Playing with your clit? <laughs> <laughs> or, like, I don't know, the female version of that. <laughs> <laughs> no, I was playing with Barbie. 11? Yeah. That's normal. I was a late I, I don't remember 11 at all, dude. Me neither. What grade are you in 11? Sixth grade? Six. Because six, six. six is the, for, for me, in my school, that's, in fifth. that's when you start realizing, like, I think in fifth grade, you're like, oh, wait, there's an extra cool factor you can achieve now. So now kids, they start, like, doing their hair more because all of a sudden you have an image. Yeah. So I remember fourth grade and under, like, Kids smell like shit. Yeah. There's fucking boogers hanging out. Like they don't yep. give a shit. But then I remember in fifth grade, I was I remembered like, <laughs> oh, wait, I gotta be cool. And in sixth grade, you gotta be really cool. And then almost when you're like 11 or 12, it's like, I gotta be a man. I gotta even you know what's fucking right? weird? Like I I can't remember what it's like to be at that age. So, but um, you know the walk that I do in South Pasadena. There's like uh, high schools and junior highs there, and then you you'll hear like these kids talk, and they talk like it's like kind of. Interesting listening to their conversations like this girl this, these two little girls. They were just like, oh, yeah So like, okay, I know why Jimmy's treating me that way I'm, I'm, I don't know remember the boy's name, but I know why he's treating me that way It's because I was acting a little weird was I acting weird. She goes no, you're fine You know like these yeah, two yeah. little girls are yeah. talking about like their social interactions with the boy I'm like what the fuck is this how we talk? When we yeah, that's like yeah, 11 when you're like we talk that way. when you're like 10 or 11 You think you're way older than yeah. you are. Yeah, that's what it was. That was what that conversation was like, oh, You weren't being weird. You know what it is? It's actually because of this this and that and I'm like damn that you elevated as fuck little girl yeah. fucking weirdo Yeah, that's how we all felt yeah. like we all felt yeah. like we were big-ass grown-ups already when we're not even teenagers yet. I remember I was doing kung-fu and so for every Halloween I wanted to wear my kung-fu uniform how cute. Until when I was like 10 or 11. I'm like, nah, that's just gay my mom's like, you don't want to wear your kung fu uniform this year anymore? I'm like, nah. I'm too old for that shit. Yeah. <laughs> and when you drop me off for school, park over there. Okay? Yeah. I'm going to walk over here. Damn, you must have hurt your mom's feelings. I know. <laughs> that does hurt. I never had that phase where I was embarrassed for my parents. I think my parents were embarrassed at me and they would try to bus drop me off way before. I'm like, no, drop me off in the front. They're like, no. <laughs> yeah, I was never embarrassed for my parents. Well, you guys don't have my parents. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? This is this is very true though. So it's a Good point, good point, good point. I feel like a lot of kids feel that way though. When my brother first told me like, no, drop me off here. I was like, oh, give me a kiss. And he was like, after, after school I will. And I, was like, I know, Isaac recently reached that age where he doesn't want to hold my hand in public anymore. Aww. And he also so He's understanding me, the cool yeah, factor. Also asked me, he was like, "Mommy, um, can you stop calling me baby in public?" And I'm like, "No, I will not. You are my." Baby. I love how he still calls you mommy though. Yeah. Uh, I was like, yeah. No, no, no. He doesn't call me. He doesn't call me mommy. He calls me. Tiffany. 
Mum. Mum. Hey, he Tiffany. Hey, he Tiffany. loves <laughs> British culture dark. stuff because like Harry Potter and everything. Oh, like, God, so that's about funny. it. He's been calling me mum for like three years now. <laughs> that's tight. Yeah, it's so cute. <laughs> also, you want to hold on to his babiness. Fuck yeah. Oh, mommy. I mean, mommy. No, no, no. I, you said that he calls yeah. you mommy. Yeah. Mommy. What the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> mama, 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 mama. But yeah, I told him like, okay, fine. I don't have to hold your hand in public. I get that, but I'm calling your ass baby forever. I don't Aww. give a shit. Not my, my fucking kid. My kid's gonna open mouth kiss me till he dies, dude. <laughs> dude, are you gonna be one of those? Daddy that's on the like, lips right now. That's like, oh, that's my baby to their girlfriend. Um, or are you gonna be cool with this girlfriend? No, I'll be cool with that. Cause I've always been lucky and had amazing suegras. I have never like belittled me or anything right. or like tr like never gave me my place so I'll make sure to do the same. So what about when his girlfriend calls him baby and you call him baby? There weren't well, she's not gonna baby. call him baby, she'll call him papi dude. Don't fucking worry about that. Hell yeah. Look at the guys. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> papi Isaac. I got both uh, Casey and Isaac like my, my baby, my baby. Mm. And then they'll be like, they'll both be like yeah and I'm like oh no wait. That big. big one, big one, little <laughs> no, one. No. Oh yeah, do you call Taika your baby? Um, I call him a lot of things. No, uh, he's my monkey dude, my baby. Yeah, I call him a lot of things. Right. Hmm? Why? Why do you make that? Are you baby? jealous? No, no. I was wondering if like we're gonna have that situation where you say no. Monkey, I call you Papa. And then we go. No. Oh yeah, Papa. Yeah, yeah I don't call Casey anything else. Just baby. Baby or Casey? Wait, was Papa always a thing? Or was it was it ever baby with you guys? It was baby too. Oh, it was. It was never babe. Oh, babe is kind of weird. Yeah, I've never called him babe. Yeah, baby's well, a thing. Fucking Mariel did the other day. She was like washing the dishes and shit, and she goes, "David." I was like, "Don't you ever fucking call me David ever." Yeah, that's weird. You call me by the fucking original name, which yeah. is in Korean is Chagi, which is like sweetie. Why did he call? Why did she call you David? I don't know. It fucking blindsided me because I was like, Gay not doing French. anything wrong. And she's like, she goes, "David." I was like. The fuck? That's how I feel. Oh, that means that she needs your attention. Yeah, I was like, I was like, are you mad? She goes, no. Are you mad? Like, don't, don't, don't make. Yeah, it feels up. weird calling him Bart. Yeah, yeah don't me call too. me fucking David. What's wrong with you, dude? I can only call him Bart when I'm referring to him in a conversation with someone yeah. else. Mm. Yeah. Even if it's we're at Costco and I'm like three aisles away, I'm yeah. like, hey, hey, hey. <laughs> and then finally, no, like, he'll see mom there too. G -yo. <laughs> That's like, like my last. It's like my last resort. Yeah. That's how I feel when you guys call me Tiffany. I'm like, whoa, who's that? Like, I'm so used to hearing Tiff from you guys. Tiff. And then you guys call me Tiffany. I like Tiffany though. Like, I also, I want to call sure. Joe Joseph, but. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. No one ever opts to call me by my full name ever. I Your name is has way too many I syllables, know. bitch. I think it's just I too long. How do you say it in Spanish? Hail. Hail. What the hell? <laughs> yeah, yeah. What the hell? What the hell, Vada? Yeah. Who keeps calling? My mom always calls me Hail. All right, guys, I haven't told you the story yet, oh, but yeah. I pretty much said it all in the headline. Uh, this 11-year-old boy from China. Oh, yeah. oh God. Oh, uh, how do we make it? Yeah, he's so bored. I get oh, it. Yeah. I, know. I have I such a huge dick. Up. Not these specific ones. Oh like my god, I was like, what photo. the fuck? Not these specific ones. But they're saying that these balls were like five millimeters. Oh, they're diameter. really small. Oh. And what? he stuck 70 in there. So he had. It this. probably felt really good. He had. Is there an extra? No. <sighs> That'd be fucking funny. <sighs> That's like if you get a catheter in your dick. That shit fucking Oh hurts. yeah. It hurts so bad. He probably had a heavy ass dick once it's filled up. <laughs> <I know. laughs> so he was complaining of pain in his stomach and that's why his parents took him to the hospital. And then that's when an x-ray showed that he had all these balls in his bladder. And so they had to <gasps> open him up Ooh, so, fucking like, idiot. He's so oh, yeah, embarrassed balls. as a parent. They're like, uh, just to let you know, your kids shove metal balls in his dick. <laughs> Dude, but, but I think you know it's what? so common. Don't even do the surgery. Just it is. It's so they were so saying common. that there are two to three cases per year of boys between the ages of 10 and 15 inserting 15. items inside of 15. 15. Okay, you know so let me ask you guys this. Since you're a mom, and Isaac's about to get in that age. <laughs> he's when, in the, he's when, 11. When Isaac's 15. Would you rather catch him with 70 metal balls in his dick or him smoking cigarettes? Cigarettes. Smoke cigarettes. See, it's like a normal kid. Like a <laughs> like fucking a normal, normal kid. And honestly, kid. smoke weed if you're gonna smoke anything because cigarettes is just, I mean. Yeah. Not when you're not when you're under the age of 18 though. Like, weed can fuck up your brain a lot. Yeah. Really? Yeah. When you have yeah, underdeveloped. Your brain develops first. Yeah. I mean, yeah. smoke fucks oh, up your lungs. Oh fuck, that explains a lot. Yeah. Then it doesn't, it doesn't hinder like mental development. Growth, so mental like, growth. You could, you know, that'll fuck you up, but at least like after seven years. Hey, you know, I uh, smoked a lot of weed. 
I'm You're okay. You're pretty fucked up. There are so many clips of you <laughs> fucking up the English language, just to let you know. I smoke no weed, you know. and I fuck up the English You've language. never smoked weed? Oh, yeah, I have, but not. I don't oh. do it all the time. Oh, That's not my thing, you know what I mean? Yeah, 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 yeah. It's um, I mean, but hopefully there's, like, another option other than, like, sticking metal balls in your dick and smoking cigarettes. I gotta tell Taika this now. It's like, well, Yeah, that's such a weird thing to have to tell your kid at 10. He's like, hey, by the way, don't shove anything in Yeah, there. you're gonna get really curious. It's gonna be a fun little toy for you. Go ahead. Just don't put anything in there. I think you're generalized. No, you tell you, don't put anything in your nose, in your ears, in your dick. Yeah. You know, like, why don't li little girls don't do that? We're not sticking fucking things up there. No. Like, that was never The girls that you know, I've heard of Catholic schoolgirl stories where they're like shoving carrots and shit. But that's there. for sex and not leaving it. And I guess uh, the, I guess it's the same. Maybe for him it was for sex. Right? Like maybe it older, felt good. Hornier? I don't know. Maybe it felt good for him. So they said that because these were magnetic and stuff, it was kind of hard for them to remove it. Well, they did a minimally invasive operation. Why'd they just get a big ass magnet? And then just oh, oh, can you imagine if it just went boom? It just all like, shot out. The whole body just <laughs> through his like, oh no, that would hurt so So they said bad. that after they took out about 50 balls, the remaining ones formed a line and they just took them out in one go. Oh, so it did work. I was wondering Where do you even get those magnetic balls from? Why did they have them online? That? You could get 200 for under 10. But why do you need it? <laughs> what is so it used for? If you want to try it. it. Like they could create design. I actually oh. considered buying some because I like seeing those videos. Well, don't put them in your house anymore. Yeah. Well, buy bigger ones so they can't right shove now. them in there. No, yeah, I like the ones that are like about this big. And then yeah. you can make like boxes and cubes and then you see them like just creating shit. Oh. I like watching those videos on Instagram. Uh -huh. They're really entertaining. But yeah. I don't know, man. That's pretty crazy. They were also mentioning that this 18-year-old, he, he stuck a 40-centimeter headphone wire into his penis. Why? And... And they try to listen for a heart, like a dick beat, or what? <laughs> <laughs> Just the wire. <laughs> and then that... <laughs> what the fuck was he doing, dude? He left it in there for a year. What? For a year. How do you pee? Yeah. He was too embarrassed to tell his family. He said that it was so painful, but he was just too embarrassed. And then there was this 13-year-old that had to have um, a 10-centimeter electric wire removed from his penis. Damn. And they found that wire knotted in his bladder. You see, aren't you guys kind of sad that you never tried putting shit in there? It probably no, feels because really good. From a doctor's standpoint, they could probably, just based off of the medical injury, you can tell if they're a loser or not. 100%. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, we were you were just having sex. You're like, or these guys are fucking losers. It's supposed to, it's yeah. supposed to hurt, though. Maybe so they some said, people like it. Yeah, so they Maybe said like that, that these are five millimeter balls, right? Diameter. They said that this boy's penis could allow an object with up to seven to eight millimeters to pass through. Oh, he got a big old dick. <laughs> or just a big hole. Urethra. Big hole. Urethra. Just a big hole. Well, I'm okay. assuming big Imagine hole, big dick. A, <laughs> Imagine having a little dick in a big hole. Oh, that would suck so bad. <laughs> like dude. a chode. Hey, no shame. So the cum just comes out like a cannon? <laughs> like a ball? <laughs> Perfectly formed ball. I know. Knocks her out. A cannon. It's just this one just fucking. <laughs> I totally pictured that shit. Yeah. Damn. Fucking gross. <laughs>